Hey guys, is it just me or do you guys also feel a little bit frantic trying to prepare yourself for the holidays and possibly holiday travel? Um, and at the same time, you know, really wanted to stay on top of your fitness, you know, on top of your nutrition and your workouts. Um, Cause that's exactly where I am right now. If that sounds anything like what you're dealing with, then definitely stay tuned. All right, so here's a look into what I'm actually juggling right now, and I hope you guys can provide you know, any advice, any tips, any thoughts that you have. Just leave it in the comment section below. Looking forward to seeing those. Now, you may or may not know if you follow me on Instagram that I've just gotten back home from a long Thanksgiving holiday with my wife and my in-laws. And in a couple of days, I am actually heading to Jamaica to visit my family. And there's all this stuff that I know needs to happen between now and then. So I definitely need to stay on top of my workouts and training. I need to stay on top of training with and coaching my clients. Um, need to, to stay on top of all the day-to-day -day for running my business. And then on top of that, you know, I probably haven't mentioned it here, but I have two other businesses that I'm also running. Uh, one in medical communications, so hardcore science. Um, nerding out right there and another is a landscape photographer and it is a pretty busy time of year right now for photography as well so everything just feels like it's running along at 100% and I'm you know trying to catch up and stay on top of everything so you know for sure for you guys the challenges are going to be different the specifics but it's likely that you're probably dealing with similar challenges you know a busy holiday season coming up wanting to and needing to spend time with family but at the same time you know you want to stay in shape during the holidays. Um, so here is a little bit of insight into what my plans are so far. And you know, let me know what your plans are, let me know what you're dealing with, and for sure leave advice down in the comments. So in about a week and a half, something like that, I will be heading from home in Hawaii, Kauai to be specific, to home in Jamaica. And that's gonna take me more than a day with all the layovers. I'm going to be down there for about a week. So obviously I am super excited to go see my family and friends that are still there. And I already know that I'm going to be pretty tempted to not work out at all or not work out very much. And then there's going to be tons of Jamaican food. So obviously I'm going to be tempted to eat as much as I possibly can because here is my one opportunity for probably a couple of years to go into total full binge mode on Jamaican food. So, you know, I'm already giving myself the talk to try to make sure I don't fall into too many traps that I'm gonna regret come January. Um, and I think that right there might be the key, at least for me, you know, to use my imagination and think about, you know, what the challenges might be and to start to get creative now and make a plan that's gonna work for me to have fun, for me to relax, but also to not totally get off the rails. And I think the number one thing that I'm gonna have to do will be to build a couple travel workouts into my morning routine. So. Right now, I think I'm, I'm gonna plan on getting up about an hour and a half earlier than everybody else, hopefully every day, um, or hopefully I'll get close to that. And then, you know, just go out to one of the gyms that I'm gonna be close to and lift for about a 45 minute workout. Now, I'll tell you, I'm gonna try, you know, if I can get to the gym where my fitness journey started at the end of high school, I'm gonna get there. I will make a quick video and post that for you guys, but no guarantees. I don't know for sure that I'll make it there. Now, food. There are some must-have dishes. Use Google when I say these names. Um, stew peas, ackee and saltfish. Look it up, Google is your friend. If you don't know, you need to know. Um, jerk pork, obviously. Fried fish, jerk chicken. I'm gonna go nuts on those things. Um, there are tons of others, but I don't wanna get into that too much. I'm gonna really start thinking about them. So hopefully I'll be able to space those things out. So instead of being fat and happy, I'll just be good and happy. Um, I'm obviously going to be taking time while I'm there, you know, not only to do my workouts, but to support my clients. You know, I'm going to be in total online coaching mode. So even though most of my clients are also going to be busy with their families, you know, I want to make sure that I am, you know, with them every step of the way so that they can get in their workouts and stay as much as possible on top of their nutrition. Now, that's what I've, have, I've figured out for myself so far. The part that is going to need some work is figuring out other you know activities other ways to exercise to just keep myself moving 
and avoid the temptation to just, you know, lay on the beach, just lounge all day long, beach or pool with, you know, a couple of drinks, not necessarily alcohol. And, you know, one thing that's not crossed my mind because I won't is this Jamaican does not run. So I'm not going to be running on any beaches. I will leave all the running to the professional Jamaicans, not this guy. Um, so that's pretty much what is currently on my mind, trying to make those plans, trying to figure out how to all, you know, get it all done. Um, figured I'd just share that with, with you guys. Hopefully you can give me some advice. Um, hopefully my two cents worth of a plan so far can help some of you guys out there manage, you know, the busy holiday season with all the travel, you know, all the events, um, all the tempting food and everything else and still try to get your workouts in and don't get too crazy. Um, I will of course continue to keep getting content out to you guys even while I'm away. And I would love your support, you know, give the video a thumbs up and for sure, you know, subscribe to the channel and click that notification bell, get the notifications for every week's video. Um, there's a part of the trip that I'm deliberately leaving out for now. So the second part of this holiday trip is something I'm pretty surprised that I'm actually thinking about because I'm a tropical kind of guy. From Jamaica to Hawaii, I mean, yes, 11 winters, we won't get into that. Um, but stay tuned for more of what that last part of my holiday vacation is going to be. Um, and until the next video, which might likely come to you while I am in beautiful Jamaica, I will just say to you guys, aloha from Kauai.